So, what is going on in the dandy garage oh, hi. this morning? Oh, You interrupted me. Um, I've been working all day, tirelessly, on um, all the shock tuning type all of those. things and all yeah. the springs and uh, just lots of different types of things going on around here. What have yeah. you been up to? Oh, uh, you know, just hanging out, relaxing. Oh, well, me too. Yeah, none of so, those. No, no. But let me tell you. So, this is the new setup. Take a quick gander at it. Thank yeah. you to Danny, Steveson, and Rob. You might know him as Robert Mello. That's what they call him. Yeah. You guys rock. You're awesome and rad as usual. They came over and busted this out in less than a weekend after an Arizona trip that somebody did. Too much driving, not enough sleep. I'm not going to go into it. But anyways, um, and Ned, Jeep. JD, I miss you. Greg, Russ, you guys are awesome. Rex, I heard you were out there too. I saw you driving. Be careful, please. Um, but thank you guys too for your kindness and just for uh, being amazing people. And now we are so super excited to let you all know that we are going to be the official NorCal dealer for um, MTS Off-Road. If you've watched any of our videos, I'll put a link below to the playlist where we first met up with the guys at MTS. These guys are the real deal. They're great people. We fell in love with them. But more than that, like, they actually do have a product that I am super proud, and so is my heavy Darren, to stand behind. We've been running them now for a couple years. They are amazing to deal with, and they really put their heart and soul into the product. And we are so lucky to be able to work with them. So that's our new endeavor. Um, you guys, you can... Uh, Reach out to us. You can contact us via YouTube. You can go to the Facebook page. We're going to put contact details below. We have phone number, all that jazz. Matt Fresh right. Shop, too. Mm -hmm. yes. And uh, we have already put up a couple of videos. You might have seen those, Ben, announcing the fact that we are going to be, uh, or we are now, uh, MTS Off Road. Uh, Authorized dealers. You can't so. get these banners just for being their friend. <laughs> so here's the thing. Uh, we uh, are going to be offering all kinds of services. So anything from uh, rebuild your shocks to tune your shocks. Check to your nitrogen levels. Check your nitrogen levels. Spring, spring kits. Yep. And we can sell you a spring kit or a spring kit, or we can install a spring kit. So we can ship to you if you want to do it yourself, or you can bring it here and we can uh, we can set it up for you. And yeah. somebody's gone to Arizona and done some training with the boys at MTS. Aside from the fact that, as you may know, he's pretty handy and handsy, but. Um, Yep. So let us know what you guys think about this, and we're excited to be able to meet even more of you. We'll be in Glamis, so we'd love to meet with you and talk to you. We'll be booking appointments at that point, no, This too. video may be up after that, but we'll be in Glamis several times. Yeah. So here's the thing. Uh, uh, we can offer, if you're local here, you can bring your car over, or you can bring your shocks over. There will probably will be a price difference on those two. You can ship your shocks to us if you're in this area. Uh, or even and if, if you're, you're out of the area. Well, yeah, if you're in, in our, within our area. And then also, if uh, you're super local, we can even pick your car up. How about that? Because so you that. saw that we have done the trailer. We got it all dialed in. That's so right. we've redone this whole shop. Dandy's garage is in full effect. We are open for business. On this side of the line, we have shocking. <laughs> That's all I don't know. So, so we're going to open up something for you right now. Yeah, we had to invest in a few new tools. Some of our uh, some of our previous tools weren't going to hold up to the to the uh, I don't know the volume of work that we will probably will be. And doing we're not going to skimp. And yeah. we're not going to do it wrong. Just they don't do it wrong. They go about it the right way, which is why we've aligned with them. Um, so we're gonna we're gonna keep their name in a good standing. All right. So we're gonna open up something right now. We're gonna be using a lot of. And we are Honda. going. Wait, oh, sorry. We're gonna we're gonna give you a quick little tour of what a if you were to buy a spring kit or uh, we were to install a spring kit for you, what what that would entail. Uh, we have we will be doing a full tune on our shocks. Right now, we are doing a spring kit on our shocks, and then uh, we'll put up a video soon of a full tune. So MTS has done all the work. We tell them what the car is, you know, all the specifics. And what kind of riding we do. Yeah, all, we give them all the specifics, what kind of riding, you know, all those things that they need to know. They give us the tune, we install the tune. How awesome is that? And, tune in a box. Yeah. Now, there are adjustments that can be made, so if you get the tune installed, you need a few adjustments once you get out there, we can definitely help with Which that happens. and make that happen. Absolutely. That happens because there's certain things. You think you do ride one way or, I mean, whatever. There's ways to adjust. All right. Let's do this. Let's do it. Brandy Hoover reports you live. Dundee's Garage, I believe, is the name of this shop. Uh, here, meeting with the owner, Mr. Darren Hoover. So, what are you doing today? We're getting ready to open up this new tool so we can uh, get a spring kit installed on our uh, 
uh, Turbo S. But okay. this this is also big news for Northern California residents who wish to have their shocks and suspension redone, right? Absolutely. Okay, guys, that's enough of that. But honestly, I'm super excited to be able to do this. Um, it's been a long time coming, and, you know, good things come to those who wait and take time and research. And, you know, my hubby, that's the Hoover Maneuver King right there. Oh, it's like Christmas. Except Santa didn't bring this. We bought it. Stupid Santa. Like, when does he stop bringing you stuff that you don't have to pay for? God. I'm going to sit this way. Let me show you. Okay. I really like the way this bench came out. I'll tell you what. The bending of the steel. This thing is freaking solid. Hubby got all this set up last night. That's going to be... Oh, God. You know, devices and whatnot to do all this shocking type of uh, things that we'll be doing. Look at all this. I'm excited. And it, oh, look at that. Okay. Oh, it looks like it's uh, actually filling together already. Well, that's good news. Some assembly required. Like the bench. Some assembly Some required. Assembly required. No you, the bench was just a pile of steel that you bought. Battery's not included. Yeah. Oh, I like that movie. The main, that's the main body of the spring compressor, the SK3000. So oh. there's a spring uh, that was supposed to happen. That's absolutely supposed to happen. Mm -hmm. So, you know, I think we're probably going to have to touch on these. Oh. So we'll be right back. Yeah. Sir, you seem to have come a long way here. Well, it's actually pretty simple. It's actually, I mean, it's really assembled. Uh, it's just a matter of... Uh, Dropping this piece into the base, and then the top assembly into the into this piece. Right, and then making sure it's it in. free of burrs. So gonna, yeah, so we're going to thread this in now. That's going to smack me in the face, probably. Yeah, that's what she said. So thread this in. That thing's cool looking. It's a little bit more heavier duty looking than some of the stuff we have. Yeah. Okay. Remove styrofoam. Also follow all proper procedures and do not disassemble the gear housing because that is the main cause of malfunction. We did not disassemble the set gear housing. We would never do that. We actually didn't, but... Okay, we so we're putting the... Oh my god, that's my favorite kind of handle. Is that the like one that looks like... Oh yeah! I know, laugh at me, I like it. It's like you're steering a ship or a yes, wing nut. Yes, yes, a wing You know I like a wing nuts. We need... Uh, and a ding bats. Oh. Well. And... <laughs> <laughs> Zero comments. So uh, let's do this. I'm gonna have you uh, grab me a wrench that is this size right here. Okay. So what are you doing? I'm getting a wrench that's the same size as this bolt. Oh yeah, I forgot about that. All right, here we go. So uh, yeah, we're close. I and then we'll like do a little bit of that action over there. It's not gonna be a how-to. It's just gonna be show you what we have going on. I wish I would have taken you with me so you could have seen that I just got that on the first try. Yeah? God. 14? Yeah. Okay. All right. Ooh, ah. Jack Tech. All right. So now what we're going to do is, actually we're almost done. So we're going to drop these in. Oh. All right. Instructions do seem pretty decent though. I mean. I did. Okay. I think what we're going to do is uh, drop a shock on and show you how these work. All right, shock doc. Right, work, for work, work your magic. Okay. What do we have here? What are these shocks off of, sir? These are off of our four-seater Turbo S. So we're off a of 2021 Turbo S. They only have, uh, uh, three, what, 300 miles on them? Yeah. And honestly, they are already, uh, sagging. sagging. Yeah. So we want to address that now. They're sagging now. You know what that means. So All right, drop so, it in like that. Okay. And bring this up. Oh, I'm going to spin that wheel soon. Yep. And then you going to get these guys kind of lined up. Something like that, so they're kind of even. Okay. And then literally just bring it down. That easy. Really? So I stack up and it's going to pop off and hit me yeah, in the face? it's not the worst idea. In case. Oh, well, it's going to hit the camera first, so I think I'm safe. Yeah, I need to drop that rubber stopper down. So I'm going to hold my Okay. 
but the bad side. Remember how hard compressing springs yeah. was without Yeah, do you this? want? 20 minute job, what do you mean? Yeah. That's all. That's it. That's it, huh? Yep. These but, guys go bye bye. Wow. Okay, that really is amazing to me. That's even I could do that. So here's the thing. Let me show you real quick. Okay. When you're doing shock tune, one of the things on a Turbo S mm -hmm. is that what you have is a tender spring and a main spring, right? Okay. That really, its only job is to keep this spring from coming off of its perch when the shock is fully extended. Okay. Where with a true dual rate system, we have a couple extra strings here that's for something else, but. With a true dual rate and a divider, what you have is these springs working together in combination. Say, so oh right? shoot, okay. And then with a the crossover, when you reach the crossover, uh, you go to the hardest spring, that's when you're in. So some would say they're working in tandem. Yeah. Okay, so we got that little the bottom piece on, that's the, the part one. I don't know what it's called. Right, so one. this is your upper spring. So. Upper spring, okay. And then you'll have a divider. Looks uh, like a cuff. Yep. Separates the two, so you're riding on the upper Again, spring until kind of, you hit that. Yeah. Until you yeah. like are about to bottom out, then you start yeah. using the stiffer spring, so you don't bottom out, right? Yeah. And so you throw it together something like that, and then uh, when you're done, you have your crossover ring, which is this guy here. And we have all the measurements, measurements right here. We're just kind of showing you how we're it goes. We're just doing right a now. quick little reenactment. This, obviously, uh, your preload has to go way up here. Okay. So we're not even close. I'm just kind of showing you how this goes together. So this will go way up here. This goes here. And then as you're traveling, this guy would hit the divider. Pushes you into using, the stiffer, using the stiffer spring. So you don't bottom out. So the thing is, you're cruising along, you're on a softer spring. Nice to and comfort, smooth. Through the smooth. Wolf, through the little chatter, bottom About to stuff G like out. That. Yeah. And also, another key point to that is that you have enough ride height that your, your, uh, that your uh, piston inside your shock is not already in the hard part of the shock. There's a bypass and then there's the hard part of the shock. Okay. So, and we're, we'll be doing some tuning on these shots as well. And that will also get adjusted. Right. You know, how much... Uh, how much bypass there is, how much... Uh, Do you adjust the nitrogen it, levels? Is that where that comes into play? Or? That's also another, that's another factor. So it all works together. Okay. Springs as well as shim stacks and MTS has their own custom proprietary piston system. Boom. It goes inside the shelves. Okay. I'm pretty so, stoked, are you? Oh, yeah. I cannot wait. I'm like, seriously, I can't wait. To no, I know. Show. And not only, I mean, not only have we been riding on the tune that they had prior, and the stuff that they've been, you know. Yeah, this will be the first time we've gotten to have the pistons, their MTS pistons on our car. And I mean, I'm, we have been so amazed with what we've had so far, so I'm yeah. excited. Yeah. And I'm excited to be able to bring that to all of you guys. When I was there in Arizona, I did drive a two-seat Turbo S mm -hmm. with their piston, their and most recent I saw thing. the video. But a Turbo S two-seater is, is a little Rough. hard to get. It's not just that it's rough, it's the back end just is not in control. It does buck, it does yeah. buck, buck roost. A, a, we drove a brand new two seat in Glamis. Our pro and, did and that the, too at first. And, and it comes around. It walks well, around. Well, yeah, that, definitely the pro did. And our four seater does some, yeah. you know, even though it's a four seater. Yeah. But that two seater, the back end, of that the one I drove, I'll show you the video right here, it was very stable. Insert video, it looks stable. Ah. faster guys were going and in. it had basically this tune on it probably maybe this exact tune on that i can't can't promise yeah you that. i think it is actually so anyway that's what's going down i'm pretty excited I'm really um excited. i'm pretty proud of you for all the work that you put into this and all the traveling you did last week and how you still just kicked ass right. i'm really really happy to be working with all of our boys over at mts good yeah. people yeah. and uh looking forward to helping our subscribers friends followers all these people yeah. Uh, get that kind of ride that we've been riding and experiencing for the last couple of years because it makes it so much more enjoyable. We already have some people coming on. Uh, Uriah has a tune sitting right over there. He's going to be blown away. He's never. It'll changed. change your world. 
He's never driven anything but a stock can am. To be able to do, do this kind of stuff for people, it's 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 it changes the way people ride. So if your wife doesn't like to ride with you because she says it's jarring, come do this and then let's see how she likes it. That's all I'm gonna say, right? Yep. All right, guys. Well, thank you for watching. What do you say? I say Brandy knows what to say. Thank you guys for watching. If you haven't subscribed, please do it now. You're already here. We have lots, obviously, lots and lots of cool stuff coming up. Glamis riding season is upon us. Two weeks out, we'll be in Glamis for Camp Not Razor. Um, hope to meet up with a lot of you guys there out in the sand. Um, give us a thumbs up if you like what we're doing. If you don't, just hit that dislike button two times and we will consider it done. You know what I mean? Ugh, over it. Um, lots of links below, Facebook groups that we're in, um, our Facebook group, so you can see where we are, we can see where you are, we love sharing with you guys, so leave us a comment, we love hearing from you. Looking forward to riding with you and meeting you. Come get your shocks tuned!